Uh-oh. Oh, jeez, oh, she blocked the whole screen. She basically blocked the whole sun. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Demons Never Lie, Part 2. I'm gonna hop right into it, okay? Without further ado, let's see what's going on. Alright, so I kind of forgot what we were doing, but we can check this out. So we have the ATM right here. Uh, yes, it is an ATM, John. And then we have our mother's credit card. Let's use it. Uh, please enter your card's pin. Remember that your pin must contain four numeric characters. Uh, probably a date. A date that is important to my mother. But, uh, which one? Um, one, two, three, four. Oh. Damn. So maybe we have to go back to our house and figure that out. I'm not too sure. Um. Isn't this like... Hold on. I'll get to this dog right here, but... Okay, old newspapers. Another girl missing in the city. That makes 10 this year. All clues point to the serial killer Ojo. Who was arrested years ago, but escaped from prison. Since he killed Aurora, the daughter of the former police chief... Al chief I was gonna say officer. Police chief Oliver. The case was closed. When will he be safe? When will you be... We, 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 we. The article ends there. Perfect. Alright, look at this map. Fallen Angel Park. Interesting name. Um, Alright, dog. You look like the one in our mother's pictures. Looks like my mother's dog. Is it you, Cookie? Cookie, Cookie, come. Good boy. What a vicious dog. Can't come any closer. Uh, we have a sandwich. Take this. You flea bag. Oh, he ran away. Well, I guess we can save. Okay, yep, continue. Alright, what? Oh, we can look at this trash can here. Nothing interesting in the trash. Ah, oh, okay, well, that makes sense. Ah, uh, only works with coins. We don't have any. What's going on with this chick? Gotta check her out. Excuse me, have you seen a lost little girl? Blonde, wearing a pink dress? I haven't seen her, sorry. Damn, where should where could she be? I'm so worried. Don't worry, I'll try to find her. Really? Oh, thank you so much. Now we have a new quest, to find the missing girl. I don't know, probably dead. Oh, okay, what's this? Some cartons on a bench. This park serves as a home for in indigenous, indigenous, ingenerates, degenerates, there we go. It can't be. Again? Are we having flashbacks? We sure are. Oh, it's me. In the future. I'm hungry. The cold is worse. All my life living on the street. I just don't get used to the cold. I hope to die soon and end this suffering. If when I was young I had known what the person was planning in my own house, everything would have been different. I wish I had known that back then. Wait, whoa, 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 First off, what's going on in my house? Second off, you weren't there before. Oh, and there's the music. Thank God. Um, he said, in my own house. After meeting Lucia, I should go back home and investigate. Okay. Wonder if we can go over here. I want a hot dog. You came to the right place. Hot dog. Yeah. Cash only. I have a credit card. <laughs> Alright. Can't. I guess we can go over here. But there's nothing. There's nothing to investigate. Alright. Away with us. So. Let's go back home and try to find a special date. Uh, that would be useful for my mother. Um, It's been... Two days since I played the first part, so I am unsure of whether I've already found a code or her birthday or whatever, and I don't know. We can look at this again. A few months ago. Okay, that's not a number though. Uh, nothing of interest. Okay, 
What about this one? I do like the music in the game. It's, uh, I don't know how to describe it. I just like it. There's nothing in her room at all. That's weird. Okay. Well, I guess we leave. No, no, buddy. John, Johnny boy, leave. Damn, 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 damn. All right. There was there anything at all in our room? Um, I would assume not. Nothing we can check here. I'm not gonna save right now. We have things to do. We can't go upstairs to uh. God, what's uh, what's our maid's name? It doesn't matter. It's eh, it's insignificant right now. Um, there were sandwiches. We had sandwiches and uh, nothing I can interact with. With nothing I can act to interact with. Interesting, interesting, very interesting. Can someone please tell me? I just want the code. Give me the code. Was it in here? Was there a code in here? Okay. Now this game has taught me that we have to be very particular. Okay. My book gave the book to my mother for her birthday last year. December 12-12. Ah. That's something I didn't look at before. Okay, we're not gonna read this again as much as I'd love to. Alright, so we're gonna try 1212. Okay. I think we're onto something. I think we can get some money, and I think we can either A, use the phone, or, well, we don't have to because we have a cell phone. But we can buy a hot dog. I don't know what that will do, but we'll buy a hot dog. Maybe give it to the lady in distress. Be like, oh, sorry, lady, I can't find your daughter, but here's a hot dog. You love hot dogs, right? And then she's gonna be like, I'm a vegetarian. Is there a veggie dog? And I'm gonna be like, oh, um, no. Been correct. Choose an option. Uh, let's see the balance. <laughs> well, what? Um, what? Okay. Uh, that's, whew, that's a lot of money. Wow, my mother is super rich. Oh, you just now figured that out? Uh, yes, let's perform. Let's withdraw money. You can collect money. I have money! I don't know how much I took out, but... Okay, sweet. Well, let's... Um... Forget this old lady. We got hot dogs to buy. <laughs> We're millionaires. I want a hot dog. You came to the right place. I got cash. Don't worry, buddy. I got fat stacks. I want all the hot dogs. Give me them all, please. What's going on here? Wait a minute. Here you go. Uh-oh. I just got an achievement for gluttony. I'll eat it right away. I'm so hungry. Don't forget your change. Oh, so now we have change for the... You haven't by any chance seen a little girl blonde passing by? No, I have not. But there is a children playground at the end of this road, turning right. You can take a look. Okay, so we can do that. Or... I guess we can use this. We have no reason to use the cell phone right now. Lady, do you want a hot dog? No? Okay. So yeah, I got an achievement for gluttony and a little demon popped up. I'm pretty sure you saw that, but... Um... If you're just listening to this and doing something else, then there's your little commentary. So basically, I think, I basically think that dealing with the demon is not a necessarily bad thing, but then doing sins. I mean, that's no kids around here, but there is a girl crying somewhere. I'm pretty sure. Well, who's this? There's someone behind here. Investigate! Hello, little lady. What's wrong? Oh, it's the girl's daughter. Um, the woman's daughter. This is the girl. I hid in the playground because I wanted to play a little longer before going back home. But now I don't know where my mom is. She left without me. Boa! Boa! What are you talking about? Your mom is at the entrance of the park, looking for you. And she's really worried. Really? 
Oh, thank you so much. I'm so happy. Take this for your help. Oh, we have a flower that we can give to Lucia. Oh, it's so sweet. Oh, it's touching. Oh, I might cry. Alright, well, I guess we can use the fun. Oh, who's this? Hello, lady. Lucia. Oh, it's Lucia. John, is that you? Lucia, I was waiting for you. For my favorite girl. Give her, give her the razor. <laughs> or some dimes. Make it rain. How pretty, John. You shouldn't have bothered. No, trust me. Now, who's this guy who just walked up on us? I knew you'd be here. I'm glad to see you, John. Today I had a terrible day at work. It can't be worse than mine. Lucia, I have something important to tell you. Yeah, we've literally seen our mother die. We've seen us on the park bench. Not this one. That run right next to you. You know, old and impoverished. And then we also saw Jimmy. Poor Jimmy. Uh oh, not again. Lucy, I have something important to tell you. I've been meaning to tell you this for a long time, and today's the day. Lucia, I... I love you. John, I... I love you too, but... You know better than me that we can't get together. Why not? What about Mark and Peter? Are you asking me to leave my husband and son? Not Peter, of course, but Mark. You deserve better. You're too young. You haven't finished your studies yet. I'll quit and find a job. This is all my fault. I knew from the beginning that this wasn't going to end well. I got carried away by my feelings. This is this has to end today, right now. Please don't say that. I'm sorry, but this is goodbye. Please don't contact me ever again. It's better this way. Don't make this harder than it is. I'm going home. Mark must be waiting for me. Goodbye, John. <laughs> no, wait, Lucia! Lucia! No! Eh, who cares? Oh, see? Music back. What's wrong, John? Are you okay? You're trembling. Uh, it's nothing. Don't worry. I have a little headache, that's all. So what was so important that you had to tell me? Nothing! Nothing? Well, uh, today's Jimmy's birthday. Maybe you would like to come? Tonight? I'll try to sneak out, but, you know, Mark. I know, I know. Don't worry. Oh, it's too late. I have to go, John. See you tomorrow. Whoa, whoa. I forgot, we're 28, so the girl we like isn't, like, just a college student. She's married, bro. Uh, now I'm starting to understand why I made the deal with a strange creature. Oh, boy. Yeah, but if we would have said anything, then... She would have never talked to us again. Oh, let's talk to her. Look, Mom, he was the one who found me. Really? Oh, thank you so much. No problem. And you, young lady. Uh, oops. And you, young lady, what were you thinking? Don't ever do that again. Okay. That's not her fault. Um. Do we need to make a call? Who are we calling? Yeah, see, I don't know. <laughs> let's not call anyone. All right. Now there was a guy back there, but we weren't able to talk to him. So that's interesting. Uh, yes, I want to save. Continue. Okay. So now what? Oh, we can investigate the trash. Okay. Never mind. Um. Now what? Oh, there's Jimmy. What's going on, Jimmy? You're finally here. Let's go. If the vision is true, Jimmy will die tonight. No, I can't go. You're gonna come to my... You're not gonna come to my birthday party, but you'll lend me the car, right? Impossible. The car is broken. You can't use it under any circumstances. Are you kidding me? Seriously, Jimmy, you have to trust me. I called you this morning and the car was perfectly fine. I found out later the car is dangerous. I swear. I swear I'm not crazy and seeing things where people die and bad things happen. No. This is the last straw. No more excuses. I've said no. Cool. Great. Thank you so much, John. Oh, and another thing. Almost forgot. What the hell, man? Oh, thank you, Maria. I, I remembered your name. Yeah. Uh, you're so late, John. My god, what happened to your face? 
Uh, a guy who's gonna de get decapitated punched me in the face. Don't mind me though, it was it was fine. It's nothing. I did it. Jimmy got mad and hit me. That's terrible, what kind of friend is that? My poor child, if you want, I'll help you take care of the wound. Aw, oh, thank you, Maria. Don't worry, I'm okay. It hurts a ton, but I don't want her thinking that I'm a baby. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez, oh, she blocked the whole screen. She basically blocked the whole sun. It looks like I'm not the only one who wanted to break your face. Get out of here, Wilma. Wilma, don't say such things. It hurts me to see him like this. You spoil him too much, Maria, but he's not a kid anymore. He deserves what he got for constantly disobeying me. Well, that punch won't be anything compared to the beating I'm going to give him. But, Mom... Come on, John. You're like 28. Stop with that mom bullcrap. Don't worry. I'll talk with her later. Thank you, Maria. You're so pretty and nice. What would I do without you? You're the best thing that's happened to this family. Don't be silly. You don't have to thank me. You know how much I appreciate you. Well, both of you. You're like my family. Listen, John. Instead of getting with a girl who's married, maybe get with a girl who's like infatuated and in love with you and... Oh, where are we? Honey, honey, she's dead. She's dead. Your pills worked. Oh, wait. She's making an evil face. I don't like it. I changed them for her sleeping pills and now she is dead. Finally, we're free from that damn fat woman and all her fortune is mine. Mine! John, that spoiled brat, he won't see a penny. Ha ha ha. I'm looking forward to see his face when he finds out. Ha ha ha. Oh no. I just talked up all that good stuff about you, Maria. Why? Why? You've been faking it this whole time. I have to investigate and avoid all this because I just don't understand what's going on. Well, now I'm curious about how we died in the first place. We must investigate to Maria's room. I assume we can go there now. I don't see why not. Investigate, yes, we can go into Maria's room. Oh, look, it's a little... Uh, teddy bear? Yeah. Wow, what an adorable... Oh, she's in the bathroom. I thought she was in the kitchen. I have to hide in that screen. Oh, we disappeared. Oh, I'm so tired. I left my tea in the kitchen. I'm going to get in and take a bath while it cools. The perfect relaxing combination for sweet dreams. Um... <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah oh yeah this is you know this would be a lot better if <laughs> she wasn't just blocks wow well 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 so this is how you spend your free time spying on girls in the shower ah you no it's not what it looks like it was an accident Relax, it's okay. <laughs> I was a human like you before I totally understand. But you've seen the key, haven't you? Uh, yes, of course. Oh, of course, yes. The key, of course I've seen it. You have no idea what I'm talking about. The girl had a key hand, handing, handing from <laughs> hanging from her neck. It must be important for her to keep it there, don't you think? Yes, but how am I going to get it? It won't be, I thought he was talking metaphorical key. Like I was like, okay, yeah, I got it. I suppose you'll have to help her have a nice long nap. You mean hit her or something like that? No, man, don't be so brutish. Besides, what happens if you're not careful enough and hit her too hard? You won't be good for anything if you wind up in jail. Then what? Do I have to tell you everything? Surely you can think of something. Um. Listen, I'll manage. Don't worry, Okaso. Don't worry, I'll figure it out on my own. I like that. A little warning before I go. This girl's very dangerous, John. Who, Maria? Yes. If you're snooping and you cross her path, she won't hesitate to kill you and chop you into little pieces. Literally. Knock her out as soon as possible, okay? Okay. Thanks for helping me. I'm only helping myself. Hide. Quick. Maria's coming. 
All right, we need to go back into hiding. Now, she said she has pills that she was gonna use to murder my mother. However, we'll put it in her nice, relaxing cup of tea. Now, where were they? A cup of tea. Looks like she's gonna drink it before she goes to bed. We don't have the pills yet, okay? So we need to search around. What the hell is this? A oh, she has a pet boa constrictor. Okay. <laughs> Only a viper would love other reptilians. Uh, there's a strange medallion guarded by the snake. But who would put their hand in there? Maybe I could distract it with something. Um, I could cut it. Alright, let's not deal with that right now. Trunk is locked with a key. We need the key from her neck. Oh boy. Okay. Um... Okay, well, I guess we could try... We could try a few things with the snake. I don't know what the medallion's all about. Um... Doesn't work. I really wanted to cut the snake. Alright, what if we put change in there? No, that would make noise. Um... Jeez, I don't know. Because I don't want to leave, but we might have to to find something else. Um, Alright, so nothing worked. Uh, there's nothing else. Interesting. Maybe we have time. Maybe we can search. Maybe we can search for something that'll help. There's got to be something more downstairs then. Uh, maybe in the kitchen. Anything. We need to distract a snake. Okay. Now what would I use? I would use a stick. I would just smack it with a stick. Can I find a stick? Is there a stick somewhere? Hmm. This is interesting. Because then we also need... There's a missing uh, timer. Oh, we can go in here now, the living room. Oh, hey Wilma. Hey, mom. How are you? What's going on here? Every kind of junk food. And, and my mother wonders why she doesn't stop getting fatter. A mystery, no doubt. Okay. Can we talk to her? What do you want now? Can't you see I'm watching TV? Don't bother me. Soon I'll have to go to notary with Maria. I wanted to give you this wanted to cut you. No. Um. Uh, I got nothing to give. I'm not gonna give her a credit card back. That means we... That would be admitting that we stole it. Don't touch anything in the living room. Go to your room to study. Oh, shut up. I'm investigating plants. What's this? I wonder... <laughs> I wonder what I could throw in the fire. Uh, what's this? My father's library. Mainly books on medicine. Nothing interesting. Um. Interesting. I. Oh man. I don't know what to do here. Maybe we can throw the, uh. Money. <laughs> We've got so much of it. Let's just burn it. Can we just give her... I wanted to give you this. Here's your credit card. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna try anything else. Um, unless it's like obvious. Okay, so let us see here. So we investigated all this. Let's look back at this. Uh, someone took a bulb from the lamp. So we need a light bulb, but we don't have one. Okay. Prescription pad. We can't interact with anything there. So we need a phone number to dial. We need... There's a clock missing. Oh, this is very weird. Oh, this is very obscure. Maybe something changed. This is, this is weird. We have to look for everything here.
Is, uh, would the uh, prescription place be open now? Ah, they are. They're open. Interesting. Okay. What's going on, Tyke? Oh, let's talk to the guy behind the counter, apparently. Hello, Will. Oh, yes. Pardon me. What do you need? I need something for sleeping. Something strong. Well, for sleeping, I have some. Uh, I only have Somniferox. It's a strong enough and effective medicine. But a few drops into a drink or juice, never more than six, that could leave you unconscious for too much time. Perfect. Just what I need. I can't sell you this medicine unless you have a, pres a prescription from your doctor. Do you have a prescription? Um. Yes. Here you go. Ah, I need to go grab my Padre's prescription. Uh, let's quickly investigate uh, shelves with various medicines and syrups, mostly weight loss products. My mother has tried them all. Yeah, as she's consuming everything else. Emphasis on everything. All right, so we need to now. I believe we can go grab our Padre's prescriptions. Okay, and then we can get sleeping medicine. We can put it in Maria's. Okay, we have a direction. We now have a goal. A clear path. Now I just have to do it before the time that runs out in the episode. Quick! Grab it. No, what? What do I do? Um, I need the pres <laughs> Why can't I just take it? Is there something so wrong with just taking the prescription pad? There's always something. There's always something in my way. But we don't have a prescription. Okay. Anything changed at all. Anything. Literally anything. Hot dog man? No? Oh boy. Oh man. So what do we need for the prescription pad? Like, why can't we pick it up? Like, do we have to say, no, I don't have the prescription? And that will activate it? I can't? Okay. I'll come back then. Be sure to give a donation to the campaign against cancer while you're here. If you haven't already done so, it's for a good cause. See you soon. Uh, where can I do that? A donation box. Help with cancer research. Let's put whole fat stacks in there. Oh, we can't. Well, if we're gonna be gluttonous, we might as well donate. We have a pen. Uh-huh. See? Now that we donated and we are charitable people, by the way. Alright? That's what this channel's based on, okay? Being charitable people, even though we're sided with a demon. It's, you know, to give everyone a fighting chance. Now, we've furthered our progress. So remember, be kind and considerate. Paid for by the be kind and considerate promotion of 2019. I don't know. I'm, just, I'm not paying. Uh, my father's prescription pad used the pen. Forge signature. For the name of science. And all that is good. Sometimes you have to do bad things to uh, be good. Luckily, doctors have horrible handwriting. No one will suspect a thing. Aha, uh -huh, now we can get the medicine. Here we go. I don't know why I'm so excited. I just, this is my mission now. Like, I'm sweating. I'm getting into this. We gotta, come on, we gotta load faster. I want this. All right. All right, old man. Or should I say Will, if that is your name? I just want to skip all that. Yes, I have one. Here you go. Prescription. Uh, no more than six drops. Okay. So we don't want to, like, knock her out. Or maybe we do. I'm not sure. Hmm. I'm not. Yeah. Hmm. Doom, doom. All right. To Maria's room. What if there was an option we could totally just knock out our mom instead for no good reason? Like, oh, ma, here's a cup of tea. To make it easier for Maria to kill everyone. Alright. So, now we can use the medicine. Okay, cup of tea. Alright. 
How many drops do I put in? Five, ten. <laughs> we could put in ten drops of sleeping medicine. Just knock her right out. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Yes, we've got it all set up. Hours later. She's out cold. Completely asleep. The drops worked. Take key. Oh, touch mark. No, stop. Stop. This is not the kind of game we're playing, okay? We're not sinners. Alright, now we can use the key on the chest. It's all coming together. I wonder what could be so important to keep locked in here. It's a, a light bulb. Black. Oh, there's secret writings in my Padre's room that we'll find in the next episode of Demons Never Lie. Thank you guys for um, getting this far into the video and uh, watching, you know, I really appreciate it. There's nothing more I love than uh, keeping your guys' attention. Um, I mean, I mean, that's the point of all of this. I just want you guys to enjoy this content that I'm putting out. So, again, we will continue this in the next episode of Demons Never Lie. Tomorrow is part 14? Part 14 of Indivisible. Pretty sure I'm correct. I need to start writing that down, honestly. Okay, so I will let you go. Enjoy. Enjoy.